This will be a very quick tutorial to show you how to draw the toe-like receptor in Adobe Illustrator. Welcome to Drawball Math. This is a scientific illustration channel for scientists. Uh, make sure you subscribe to join the creative scientist community. Let's uh, jump right into the tutorial. And uh, so first you need to draw a rectangle and then uh, you need to round the corners of the rectangle and let's just zoom in and you'll see these round corner widget. So just drag on them. Uh, all the way until the sides are completely rounded. I'll change it to the orange and this is a little bit too saturated so I'll go to the color guide to make it lighter and uh, then uh, we I will apply a uh, outline and outline usually I use this gray and then uh, the thickness I change it to 0.25 points and we need to apply a highlight onto our uh, this uh, domain. So to do that, let's first make a copy and then uh, switch the fill to complete white and then move it on top of the domain and then make it uh, smaller. And then once it's ready, we uh, I will uh, make sure I put it uh, aligned to the center. Then I'll go to effect, blur, Gaussian blur, and uh, I will choose a six pixels of the uh, blur radius. Once you click OK, you see that now uh, the highlight makes your uh, shape looks uh, uh, like a rod. Uh, so uh, we will just need to copy this. And then uh, we will need another two copies in the intracellular domain. So I'll quickly do that. And then we will need the uh, TIR domain and they are really just uh, circles with a radial gradient within it. So I'll just quickly create a circle by using the ellipse tool and, and then I will just apply a radial gradient. Then I'll put this yellow into the gradient and uh, I will make it lighter. So let's go to the color guide again to uh, put a lighter version of the yellow into the gradient slider. Then uh, I will make uh, in total four copies of this uh, TR domain and um, then I'll move the entire thing a little bit downward. Let's change the color of uh, this domain into uh, green. Okay, then this one uh, I need to make it uh, half the length of the other domains. So I'll just quickly squeeze it down and you see that uh, we need to adjust the uh, the round corners so i just quickly uh, drag the round corner widget again until it's perfectly rounded and then i'll switch it to a purple fill and uh, also i'll use the lighter one so it's not uh, that saturated Okay, uh, so this is how you create a toe-like receptor. There are many uh, subtypes of the toe-like receptor. You can check them out in an example in the description below and uh, then make it according to uh, the one that fits your research. So I hope this can help you with your publication. Please give a thumbs up if you find this helpful. Also subscribe to Drawball Med for more of these videos and I look forward to seeing you in a future video.